Matt Cook here. As you may know, I have a newsletter going out to 700,000 men. I'm one of the most widely quoted experts on male health and sexuality in the world. And um, I want to tell you today about one of the hazards that nobody really talks about, and that's iron. Iron is something that we need, obviously, for our blood. Our blood uses iron for oxygenation and the hemoglobin. But iron is also a very, very dangerous metal. It's actually a heavy metal. And our body has elaborate defenses to protect against iron overload. One of the visible symptoms of iron overload is what's called lipofuscin, which are age spots. I don't have any age spots because I'm very careful. But if you have those sort of dark spots on your skin or you see some older people have, even young people have, uh, this is caused by a combination of the PUFAs, polyunsaturated fatty acids from diet and iron that your body attempts to put into these islands called lipofuscin in order to get rid of them in some way so that they're not just poisoning the entire body. So I want to show you a way of avoiding age spots and avoiding the toxicity of iron that people are not talking about. A lot of times doctors will prescribe anemia. Anemia is a wide diagnosis that they will attribute. If They'll say generally your, your blood isn't carrying enough oxygen and they think, oh, you're not getting enough iron. But a lot of people actually are getting enough iron, but they're just not getting enough they have too much iron, really. Most people have too much iron. We're having foods now. If you look on a package of bread or anything that has grains in it, it'll say it contains reduced iron. Reduced iron is added or fortified. Reduced iron is actually iron filings. It's actually little pieces of iron. It's extremely reactive and destructive in the body. You don't want reduced iron. So I always check the labels and make sure that I'm not getting something that has uh, reduced iron in it. Now, if you are getting enough iron, as most of us are, it turns out that vitamin E can be very protective. According to animal experiments that were carried out at uh, Saskatoon, Canada by the University of Saskatchewan and published, they found that vitamin E can be protective against too much iron toxicity in the liver. This is a mouse study, but it really should work just as well with humans. There's not really any great difference. And what they did is they gave various amounts of large amounts of, uh, of iron to, to mice. And if they had enough vitamin E, they didn't die from the iron. They didn't have an iron overload. They were able to handle huge amounts of iron with, as they say in the study, 100% protection given enough vitamin E in advance. So vitamin E is remarkably effective at preventing uh, potentially bad effects from excess iron on the liver. And I would urge you to consider getting a good form of vitamin E in your, um, in your supplements. Um, I consider a good form of vitamin E one that uses natural vitamin E uh, that's extracted from wheat germ. It doesn't have wheat in it, but it comes from wheat germ. It has all of the normal tocopherol mix and tocotriums and, and other compounds. So it's a, it's a fully uh, holistic product rather than something that's made from, uh, from oil or derived from even soybeans. Not quite as good as that. So that's what I consider a good uh, E supplement. Um, and what I also uh, want you to consider... This is something for, this is for men. Hey, it's us guys talking. You know, there's that moment when we're with a woman, when we show ourselves in full. Um, we want to show our best and we want to have the most sensitivity. So we, um, uh, one of our sponsors has created a uh, oil that you put on there and it helps you increase sensitivity. It helps things look better and feel better. It's amazing. And we have a special offer for that. I want you to try it out. It's in the description. Click on the link and find out about this special below the belt oil that you will absolutely love. Okay, so go ahead, get that oil. You're going to love it. Thank you to our sponsor, Ideal Mail Labs. Matt Cook here. We'll see you on the next video.